as I was walking by your booth, I noticed this is a monitor for dyslexic people. I have a lot of friends who are dyslexic, and I was so intrigued. So can you walk me through what your product is? Yeah, it's, it's a specific screen. It works for non-dyslexic people if you are in a shared office, for example. But for dyslexic people, you can set the frequency. So it's the key of the comfort of reading for dyslexic people. Now, is it just, just the refresh rate? Is there like a different type of lighting that you're using? So it, it's a specific program and hardware inside that is uh, managing the backlight of the, of the screen. So for the first time we used the backlight uh, to, to, yes, to refresh the, the light and so to, to make it comfortable for dyslexic people. So it's very simple, you will put your computer the first time on the screen and then you, can, you will have the ability to adjust. So uh, for the show I have this remote controller just to, to show you. Uh, here, at the lowest frequency, you can see it can be visible, it's 60 Hz, but each people with uh, dyslexia will uh, find the good position. Maybe it will be I, that, that position, and if you, if, you, if you stop it, it will be useful for all lifelong. Really cool, and you also have a couple other things here, you have like a lamp yes, as well. Uh, in the previous years, we were at the CES, and we have shown this light, uh, this lamp, it's, it's, it's using the same technology, so uh, we use a smartphone to select the, the position that is good for dyslexic people and then uh, this lamp is uh, also uh, helping more pupils at school. Interesting, no this is so awesome, I think it's really incredible how many people this is going to help, so keep up the great thank work. You. Thank you for your visit. Yes, thank you. Nice to see you. The world's most powerful tech event is taking place here in Las Vegas. CES 2025 is here. Be sure to follow CES on all of their social channels to be up to date on all of the latest.